All right. Hey, Earth signs. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, what is up with you? Let's see what's going on here. This is a general reading for you, so that means you can swap around the characters, okay? So uh, I could also be talking to a cross watcher. Just keep that in mind. Um, and a big loud message for me today has been, um, if you think, if you think it's, do you remember those commercials? If you think it's butter, but it's not, it's chiffon. I know I'm saying my, I'm showing my age here, very seventies commercial. If you think it's butter, but it's not, it's chiffon. And when margarine was a big thing and margarine is like the freaking fakest thing on the planet. <laughs> okay. Um, Somebody is mistaking a person for their soulmate. I just have to say it out loud. I've said it on the other two readings. Um, whether or not the reading itself plays out like that is immaterial. It's a message that needs to be said today. You could be very focused on somebody who you think is your person and they are not. So the message is kind of open up. Open up. All right, so... Let's get going for, uh, that's the maze. Oh, look at that. The storks that came out in the fire sign reading could be dealing with a fire sign in that case. Then five of pentacles. something is really strong here. Five of, well, this is the tree. This is the tree of life. So this is almost like a family tree. This is, a a getting married kind of a scenario and, or, a, a, a you know, like a very traditional kind of a thing here. This is, you have gone through a lot to get here. You've gone down some rabbit holes. You've, you know, spent a lot of time uh, chasing your tail with somebody. There's a soulmate on the path here who is um, a true life partner. And it's almost like you have to kind of um, suspend your disbelief or you have to kind of get out of your old way of thinking or your old way of believing that a certain person is your person, something like that. The universe is saying heads up, okay, heads up. So, all right. Death. Card for you. Big transformation here, earth sign. Somebody, the other person, two of swords. What's this about? <laughs> you both are just... In, uh, you both are blocking this relationship. Past life soulmates. Okay. Could be dealing with Scorpio here. You both are blocking this from happening. Let's see. How are you seeing this relationship? King of Pentacles. Okay. Like a good match for you. That somebody you're seeing them you're seeing yourself um are you seeing them as somebody who is like yourself for once <laughs> so this is a situation where in person in conversations you guys could be sort of flirting with each other but not really you're blo both blocking and this is like um uh what's that song bonnie Raitt song let's give him something to talk about these two people are not having an affair or not in love or whatever like that, but they are in love. Other people see it. Other people can see it. If you're not, if you guys are both like, no, this is, I don't know what you're talking about. That person, uh, you know, we're friends. Other people see it. Messages to you from the universe. Other people are seeing this. Two of Wands, that's very nice. You have manifested this situation. You're at a crossroads in your life here. They are too. Very much a crossroads chariot. This person is thinking about moving forward with this. They're, they're not um, asking friends or family or anything like that. They're just sort of considering it inside. This person, you, are likely to be transformed by this connection um, this person wants, does want to move forward. The universe is saying to them, Hey, knucklehead, stop doing this. You're at a crossroads in your life. It's time to move forward. Seeing the other, seeing this relationship as a real deal. 
Knucklehead, wake up. <laughs> Ten of Wands. Put down the burden. Boy, have you been resisting this hard. All right, let's see. Boy, have you been resisting this hard. Seven of Cups. This person doesn't really understand why you're resisting so much. Emperor, Six of Pentacles, Page of Wands, underneath, Four of Cups. One more, please. Wheel. Well, I can't just leave that there. Okay, wheel strength. Um, all right, I see all the fire signs here, first of all. So in the extended, I'm going to look at Scorpio, Cancer, and all the fire signs. Um, I feel like you may be wanting to, you know, it's a little bit your way or the highway. It's like, I got to do this my way. This person doesn't understand why you won't just move forward. All right. I feel like you might be in a situation where you're, um, this is the closed off feeling is for real here too. Okay. Um, moving forward into Leo energy, that's really strong passion. In the meantime, you're controlling your passion. For this person, very controlled, four of cups, page of wands, six of pentacles. Um, you're giving them little bits here and there. Um, why so controlled? Why are you controlling yourself so much? Why, why is that? What is that about? Five of Swords, Magician, Five of Pentacles, Five of Cups. Wow. Page of Swords, Ace of Swords. So you're controlling yourself because I feel like this person has appeared to be, they're going through massive change. All right, you have the death energy here of transformation. They have a lower octave of this, Five of Swords, Five of Pentacles, Five of Cups. They're going to, through massive transformation. They're confused by it. You are more. You are in a, more, a stronger position here. You're really seeing seeing your options here, um, knowing that you're wanting to move towards something stable. This person seems unstable. That's why you're backing off or you're not, you know, moving forward more quickly. They seem unstable to you. I feel like they are somebody who might have money issues. Um, King of Pentacles, you might be seeing them as someone like you in terms of stability, but there's some kind of um, subconscious knowing that, oh, maybe they're having a lot of trouble with money. So you're not wanting to move forward too fast with them because you don't, you don't want it to be about money. Okay, for them, if this person is very unstable and may have some financial issues here, they're working on it, magician, they're working on it. It's almost like they've manifested some kind of loss or some kind of uh, emergency. Okay, and they are going to tell you all about it. Ace of Swords, they're going to tell you what's going on with them. They're watching you. I feel like you, uh, you might have held back at one point. You might be moving forward into taking charge in some way, helping this person. All right. I do feel like this is a, this is a, um, a fated love creating stability member moving toward this tree, the tree of life. I mean, I don't want to, I, well, I'm going to say it. <laughs> I don't want to say it. I'm going to say it. This is like, you're moving, you're going to rescue this person. I feel like you're going to rescue this person. They don't know what else to do, right? They're single, the chariot and the magician, very much a single minded about things. And they're of one mind about something. They're not really seeing all the possibilities. So I feel like you have an opportunity here to be of some service, help this person. You may reject it being about love, or you may be like, you know, let me just help you. You might just help this person. Very, um, I like this, the Wheel of Fortune moving into the Strength card. 
tower. Yes, into your deep knowing here. Oh, that's beautiful. You're moving into this place. This person is going through a tower moment. All right, your deep knowing, nurturing of this person is going to come. They're going to tell you about some big thing that happened to them, and you're going to have to take action. I feel like you will take action to help this person. The money is, is an issue. This person might have gotten um, ripped off. They could have lost a lot of money. They could have um, had other people manipulate them into losing money or, or they got fired from a job because someone was a backstabber to them. Okay, and so this is, not the, this is not this person's fault. They're not doing anything nefarious or anything like that. And they're standing in their magician trying to you know, move forward, but they're confused. I feel like you could have a very positive impact on this person. They're going to tell you the truth about this. And I feel like you have a deep knowing, a deep nurturing love for this person. Queen of Pentacles, King of Pentacles here. Um, I had a friend in high school. This was a very, I didn't know about this until many, many years later. Um, a woman, a girl I used to know in school um, had a very abusive family. And I, I believe a father, a very abusive father. I don't know if her mother was even around. And in high school, she had this boyfriend and you know she was very closed off and not really talking and the boyfriend figured it out what was going on and he said you're gonna come live with my family makes me cry just to think about it right now they've been married for 30 years they got married when they were 17 and the true the true love he showed her was just Remarkable. So, <laughs> all right, I'm going to continue on and we'll see where we go. But I feel like that's this scenario here. This is going to change your life in a very beautiful way. All right, link is below. I'll see you over there. <laughs>